Karen Chenard runs an international paint company, and Jeremy Funky owns Vista Shine Window Cleaning and Power Wash. But every year, the power couple carves time out of their hectic schedules to hunt for shrooms. She puts in 40 hours of morel hunting a week, oh, not working. I try. I try. <laughs> morel mushrooms, considered to be the king of fungi, typically only grows in the wild, so it needs to be hunted, not farmed, making the finds sublime. You see that big morel or big patch of morels, you're like, <gasps> you know, it takes your breath away a little bit, so that's... I'm in it for that. I'm in it for the honey holes, too. Harvesting these sacred shrooms is a sport gaining popularity, with foragers and enthusiasts creating groups and scheduling weekend excursions. That's our first morel for the day, guys. Now, as you can imagine, finding morels aren't easy. The DNR posting spots, you may get lucky. Part of what the map does is show uh, where recent prescribed burns. And uh, sure enough, what often happens uh, you have a, an influx or an abundance of um, morels. It's no guarantee. Now, going on a morel hunt can be a little intimidating, but here are three tips for you. Tip number one, look for dead trees. Like this dead apple tree is perfect. Number two, it has to be the right temperature. And here in Michigan, there's about a two to three week window for each type of morel mushroom. And three, texture. It's a really good idea to look at a picture of a morel before you go on your hunt so you can train your eye to what you're looking for. I'm looking for those May apples. The tips coming from the experts, Karen and Jeremy, who were gracious enough to let this rookie tag along with them. Are you allergic to poison ivy? Am I allergic to poison ivy? <laughs> you don't know yet, do you? I do not. And about 30 minutes into our hunt. Oh! <gasps> we got one, Danny. This is great. Okay, so get low and try to see. Oh, oh my god, it was hiding completely. So you kind of pinch and break. That's it. Nice. That's your first one. <laughs> nice, very nice. Cheers. And happy hunting <laughs> in Pickney. Kiara Hay, 7 Action News.